WTFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chaplin here for the 11 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network Market Update. Dow's down 523, 32,296. Another little arch formation that pattern, the dreaded H, is lethal. Got to be careful, even if there's a round a little later on with all the uncertainty over the weekend. I'm not sure how much buying will come into the market and be sustained into the close unless it's something fantastic is mentioned somewhere. So the S&P is also down sharply. The Dow is down 1.5%. Uh, S&P is down 1.6%. It is down 72 at 42.90. Uh, if if it takes out 42.87 today, uh, I'd say just be real careful over the weekend. Look at the QQQ, NDX 100 trading um, uh, right here at 336.25. This is ugly. This is 1.7 down percent down. It's down eight uh, down six at 336.20. Uh, not a good pattern at all, and that's going to start impacting the weekly chart formation. You're looking at the IWM, the Russell 2000. Mm, it's down two percent. Uh, down four at 197.77. Also, yeah, in fact, this is the first time that the nine period moving has uh, has gone back under the 14 after it looked like it was going to turn up. This is negative. Look at gold. Gold is up $24 at 1960. This is a very strong move. Trying to head towards the 1796, uh, uh, 1976 high made about a week and a half ago. Uh, this is, you know, this is the fear factor. Gold is just, to me, the icon of uh, international fear. And we're looking at uh, the dollar. And this is like going both in the same direction together. The dollar is up huge. It's up 97 ticks at 98.71. This is a huge breakout in the dollar. And that's because up until now, the American economy, I think, is still being considered really good. And if you heard the news this morning, you know, with inflation, with with the uh, with the jobless uh, number at, at record lows and uh, number of uh, uh, jobs opening up, it just something's wrong with this picture. It's going to have to do with inflation that is going to impact uh, markets around the world. Let's go on to uh, crude oil. Crude oil holding near the highs. It's up almost five at 112.11. Made a high in the 115s yesterday. It's actually 116. I can't remember now. It went to 100 and. 16.32 this is on the continuous contract you know it's all about oil yes it's about other things but a big chunk of it has to do with the rising price of oil and the fact that we have not uh, added to the availability of uh, crude oil anyway at the moment so we're looking at something just be real careful watch the VIX index have a great weekend stay tuned for larry president of vix at 34. if it gets to the 35 that's going to hurt the market you want to see it pull back to 33. Thank you.